One of the great things about tennis, and there's a lot of them, is the fact that no matter where you play, the court's the same size. It's 78 feet from baseline to baseline. The net is always three feet high, especially if you measure it. But the real big difference in the game and the way you should play it depends upon how does the ball bounce on the court you're playing on. We all seem to play better on one certain surface, usually the one we're raised on. But you should adapt yourself to be able to play on any kind of a court that you end up playing on. Now let's go to the various kinds of concrete. They can make them slow or fast. And when you're playing on something that's fast, you're going to normally win by playing the aggressive game. But let's say that you're a steady player. The only thing I can suggest on fast courts, a steady player usually wins by defense. They're going to have to be looking for chances that they must take to keep their opponent from taking over. On a fast court, the volleys are put away easier, the overheads are more impressive, and above all, it's harder to return the serve. Now let's go to the various kinds of clay courts. There's fast clay courts. That means it's a hard base with sand on top of it. They're very slippery. And there's clay courts that are very, very slow, and you actually dig in. They're very slow indeed. So you have to adjust your game once again. The steady player loves these kind of surfaces, slippery or firm footing. But an aggressive player, boy, he's got to make some changes. He can't come in on his serve. His volleys won't be put away. The serve sort of sets up not like a lollipop, but it's easier to handle. So remember, whenever you go out on the court, check the surface you're going to be playing on and adjust your game mentally. That'll be the big difference.